The third annual Mayaka River Blues Festival started this morning in Venice and the music is playing for more than fun and enjoyment. SNN's Chrissy McClarty has that story. They just called me and, uh, and a bunch of the other locals to see uh, you know, if we can get a good uh, big festival put together for the day. So far so good. Barry Oakland Jr., son of Barry Oakland of the Allman Brothers, was one of seven bands that played at Monday's Mayaka River Blues Fest. Seven different bands. Um, it's an amazing amount of talent here today. And joined by the talent is the food. I have a River's End hot dog that's a hot dog wrapped in bacon, batter dipped, deep fried, and put on it with jalapenos, cheese, and then smothered with barbecue sauce. It's a whiskey barbecue sauce. It's amazing. Music, food, and more music. It's great. It's a lot of fun, really entertaining, uh, great for the whole family. You know. Coming out here is about more than music and fun. It's about raising money for a good cause. This is the first time that this event has been geared towards Loveland Center, and we're very excited about it because we are currently working on developing Loveland Village. Daniela Poinsett, Community Impact Officer for the Loveland Center, says Loveland Village is being built in Venice as a safe haven for people with developmental disabilities. There will be apartments for up to 94 residents and they will be affordable, safe and they will also be very supportive so they'll be able to have a really great community and at the prices that they can actually afford for living in income that individuals with developmental disabilities have. The project is expected to open in September of 2015. Many are doing their part to support the new Loveland Village one song at a time. And the project for the Loveland Village is going to take an estimated 13 million and the group is 80% of the way to their goal and hope to be even closer after the Blues event.